Men's 1500 metre freestyle final now. And Hackett is in lane two. David Davies of Great Britain, the man in four, alongside him, Larson Jensen. Second American down there is Eric Bent. Hackett's world record, 14.34.56. He set that with a remarkable swim at the 2001 World Championships. What a field. Stevens is the only one in this field who hasn't broken 15 minutes. And he is right on 15. The fastest 1500 metre field ever assembled. All the question marks around this man Hackett. He's won four in a row. They're away in the men's 1500 metre freestyle. As we look at them from the bottom, it's Pilyakov and then it's the yellow cap of Hackett. Sarimowitz it is in three. Davies and Jensen in the middle, followed by Calbertaldo, Vent and Stevens. And the man who wants to set the pace early is the 22-year-old Russian Yuri Pilyakov. That's what this first hundred's all about. Pryukov going around in front of Hackett and also Sorimovic. What do everyone, all the swimmers here do, what does Hackett do to try to tell himself, tell his body that his form is OK, that he can do this? And alternately, what do the others do to try to demoralise Hackett? They're going to have to try and break him, pretty much. But he's taking it out well, a little bit faster than what they, we saw them swim in the heats. They all sat pretty round, around the 58 second mark. That was a bit faster than what we saw. That first 100, the first 200, they're just all setting up their rhythm. They need to get into a stroke rhythm. They need to feel comfortable at a speed that they can maintain over the distance. Prilukov it is at the 150. Second place, Serenimitz. And Hackett is there in third placing. Not really worth worrying too much about the individual positions at the moment because they will sort themselves out. But at Jensen and Davies, fourth and fifth. Yes, those times I mentioned. Hackett, of course, has the fastest, the world record. But Prilukov has gone a 1451. Sarimitz has gone at 1452. Davies and Jensen both at 1455. Calbertaldo 1458. Vent 1459. And Stevens 150059. <laughs> Just about under 15 as well. Quite remarkable. You'd have to swim virtually, all but Stevens, sub 15 just to qualify. I think it's one of the fastest 1500 heats sessions that we've ever seen. Prilukov still leading. So Rimowitz it is in second place. Hackett holding third at the moment. Hackett having won the gold medal in 1998 in Perth, again in Fukuoka in 2001, in Barcelona 2003 and in Montreal 2005. And before Hackett, there was Kieran Perkins who started this Australian domination as it has been back in 1994 in Rome. So Australia with five straight wins in this event at the World Championships. Will it come to an end here? Prilukov it is still. Sarimovic in second place. Hackett still holding on to third. And then it would be Davies and Jensen. And across we go to Cal Bataldo, Vent and Stevens. Still sorting themselves out at the 350 metre mark. And the other thing I, I suppose of note, while this is such a, a star-studded field, but at the last Olympic Games and at the last World Championships, the order has been, on both occasions, Hackett Gold, Jensen Silver, 
and Davies Bronze. So we have the cream of the cream here. Park Tae Won, the 17-year-old Korean, was expected to be in the field, didn't qualify, which leaves us with this elite field. Through the 400 they go, Prilyakov from Sarimovitz and Davies moving up into third place now, passing Hackett, who's fourth, Jensen it is, who's fifth, and then Calbertaldo, Vent and Stevens. The real danger in this race is not following your race plan. It's going out with someone else that's swimming faster than you plan to swim at that point in time. They all swim their 1500s differently. You can see Prilyakov is taken out very fast. Some of them tend to split it into thirds, each 500, or they just want to split it into half and ensure that they bring the second half of the race home faster than what they swam the first half. But the danger is to swim someone else's race when you're swimming a distance like this. You've got no control over them. You can only control what you're doing. It's the Polish swimmer, Sarimowicz, who is going up now to challenge Prilyakov. The question, I suppose, Prilyakov making this pace through the first 500, can he maintain that pace throughout? Well, Prilyakov, with a personal best of 14.51, he has done it. But um, he's decided to try to force the pace early. In the middle lanes, there's we have a look at Davies and then Jensen in the black cap a little further back. But with 1.50 to go, it's Sarimovitz leading Prilyakov and Davies. And as we've seen in every 1500 heat that we watched, the last 100 is a sprint. They build it up that first 50, but once they get their feet on the wall for the last 50, it's a sprint for home. Prilyakov at the bottom, Sarimovitz in the red cap, and then it's Davies, and then it's Jensen as they get the bell lap. 100 metres to go now. The margin, just one second between Sarimovitz and Prilyakov, and Davies is third, followed by Hackett and Calbataldo. There's going to be a new order here in the 1500 metres. There will be a new gold medalist, a new champion. Will it be Prilyakov of Russia? Will it be Sarimovitz of Poland? Surely it couldn't be Davies of Great Britain, not from there, as they've got just over 50 to swim. Sarimovitz it is who leads by 1.3 seconds on Prilyakov. Prilyakov is just a little too far behind. I don't think he can bridge the body length. He's trying to increase that stroke rating. But I think Sarimovic just had too far on him. Matus Sarimovic. Yuri Prilyakov can't get there. Matus Sarimovic of Poland becomes the new 1500 metre world champion. Yuri Prilyakov takes the silver and David Davies claims bronze. A personal best time for the race winner, the gold medalist. 14.45.94, he's taken seven seconds off his personal best time. Prilyakov also going faster than ever before, but this man is champion of the world. Prilyakov also doing a personal best time. That is a big thank you there because Prilyakov took that race out fast. And Sawurimovic was able just to sit back and go with that pacing. Gryukov did the hard work early on in the race. A new world champion. He was challenged. He was threatened. But he had a big, big heart. And now... He has a gold medal to hang from his neck. Oh, yes. The men's 1500 metre freestyle, Matus Sarimovic, 1445-94, Yuri Prilyakov, 14.47.29 for silver and David Davies, 14.51.21 for the bronze. Jensen, Calbertaldo, Stevens, Hackett and Vent in that order. Hackett breaking 15 minutes just.
and Stevens breaking 15 minutes for the first this time. He'll be pleased about time, that. Yes.